There you go. All you see on CNN is anti-Trump slogans and white supremacy. But where are those good old conservative values and a faith in God? Lucky there's the Irish Ben Pod. Lucky there's two men who positively can do all the things that make us laugh and cry. We are the Irish Ben Sponsored is all I'm saying. <laughs> taxpayer funded. Right. <laughs> government funded and taxpayer f- taxpayer funded and government sponsored. Right. I gotcha. Government should stay out of it. You want to do what you want to do with your body, go do it. We're not paying for it. Right. It's not reproductive rights. It's murder rights. <laughs> the fuck your problem? I mean, what are you people, stupid? Where's all the common sense? Well, it's not even... I mean... With the people that are over there, over, the people that are really complaining about it are the ones that are like. I don't want to tell you what you do with your body. This is my third one. Well, all right, that's disgusting. Well, you know what? And they act like it's all it's all good. You know, you, you you talk to these poor women who went through that. They all regret it. They're all sick over it. it you know, you, well, some you, you got the sociopaths that are like, oh, ah, I don't care. And well, they got. Uh, yeah, but, but, I've strong, nev- but I've never met one. No, no, I'm just, I mean, when you see it on social media and stuff like that, like, you know. It's, it's. I mean, there was an actress a few years ago that said when the whole abortion thing was blown up, it was like Trump's first or second year. It was like, uh, she's like, well, if I didn't get an abortion, I wouldn't be where I'm at today as an actress. It's like, oh. Oh. <laughs> Who fucking says that? So you either sacrificed your kid to be mm. an actress in the. You know, the elite that you're in, or you sacrificed it because you just didn't care. Most people, 99% of the other people, would sacrifice their own career for their kid. Yeah. She's on the wrong side of the fence. Well, she might have got accidentally pregnant. But I don't... (laughs) Or she might have got purposely... (coughs) Might have been like a casting couch That was very funny. How do you get accidentally pregnant? With Harvey Weinstein. I don't know. I'm just saying. Maybe she didn't realize she was getting pregnant. There's no such thing as accidentally pregnant. It doesn't work that way. Well, listen. You know how we were talking about Zyrtec last week? I think we should start doing like, hey, my condom doesn't work if yours doesn't either. If you're not wearing one either. Like, is that... We need just need to start going tip for tat. Like, my vaccine doesn't work if you don't get yours. Oh, okay. How stupid is that? <laughs> How stupid is this? This has to be played at least once per show. As long as it's... I love like the, the first idea. show and not the next two shows. The next two shows? Okay, I won't play that no more. All right, but real good conversation on that. I, I don't think I, you can help yourself. No, you don't think so? <laughs> you enjoy it too much. Uh, I do. You're still stuck in the farts, like the, farts and dick jokes. The fart. Yeah. <laughs> We're trying to be serious here. <coughs> yeah, well, I don't want to be serious.